Hey guys, uh, there was a brutal police beating over on UC Berkeley, or uh, well, there was like last week, which I haven't even begun to do research on that one. I just found this UC Davis thing where these kids were, you know, sitting where apparently they weren't supposed to be sitting. The police were like, "Move!" The kids were like, "No," or the people, I should say, were like, "No." I don't even think they said no. They just sat there and linked arms and police pulled out pepper spray and started spraying him in the face. The cop's name is John Pike, the guy that did it. And I'll give you all his information below. Also, the chancellor now, uh, there's a call for her resignation and there's a petition to sign and that's what I want you to do. I just signed the petition. Sign it if you want. Uh, I, I will make this a response to or link this to the, the actual spraying incident. It's pretty awful. I guess there's always going to be a rise to power from underneath, and then it's just like a fountain, you know? Like, it comes up and out, and it just keeps coming up and out. And the people down here, the protest, and then up here, the coming out is the, the, the law enforcement that's created, eventually. But, you know, is there a simple solution? I don't know. Yeah, there is. P police should be negotiators. They should carry flashlights and not, I mean, whatever. Maybe you need, maybe you need dudes with guns and, and beat down sticks to go beat people down or threaten them to beat them down. Sometimes I really appreciate police officers. Uh, they're pretty amazing. Um, but you got to listen to the crowd. Chancellor. Let me give you the chancellor's name. This is the woman to resign, Linda Katei. Anyway, I'll link you to the petition. Have a good evening, day, year, week, month.